Oh, I should put a hat on. Let me see. Hmm. That's the first time I've ever hear, heard that. <laughs> but the guy that did that made millions. Hi, Vince. Hi, Kate. How you doing? <laughs> uh, it's late. What time is it? It seems like it's 11 o'clock. <laughs> I'm happy to see you, too. <laughs> uh, is that Kate? I got these... Uh, um, hearts all over the place. I can't see who's actually typing. Hi, Linda. I'm happy to see you, but I'm happy to see you too. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hi, Pearl. How you doing? <laughs> uh, um, you love it. I know. It's pretty cool. This Facebook Live, it just makes me happy every time I try something new. <laughs> Um, yes, you know, I was watching some of my Facebook um, reruns, the replays, and I, I noticed that I do a lot of, huh. <laughs> so I'm going to try not to. That's one of the reasons that we do Facebook Lives. Uh, this challenge is to understand what we're, uh, how we look and talk to others and how we actually act. Uh, I remember when I was younger, we were in English, I think it was, and I think back then I would say a lot of, uh, uh, hum, yep, um, what, and, you know, repeating all these questions. Um, yes, yes, I, I think that's Pearl. Yes, self-reflections and, and keep improving. Yes, that's what we do on Facebook Lives. Um, but it's also what ch uh, children do in school. They they notice uh, the, the teachers are supposed to teach them that you're being repetitive. But we sometimes forget those things. But um, I'm glad you're here. I'm glad that um, I made it home from uh, Chicago. <laughs> uh, it was a great, I, I cannot believe, all the meetings. We went to three meetings and um, they were on time. And to the point, we were able to even have lunch and still catch the 3.15, I think it is, train back home. Uh, yes, and stay focused. I need to stay focused. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Kate. So I was thinking uh, what to talk about today um, before I pass out. And um, I thought about um, in marketing, you want to get to know who your audience is. And uh, when you meet somebody and you want to talk and you start talking with them, there's questions that um, we as marketers want to get to know uh, a potential person. So I thought I'd share some of those questions. Um, and see, there it was, um. <laughs> so I'm going to catch that one again. So when you want to know your audience, you want to um, stop it. You want to get to know the, their, your audience and you want to ask them. You want to get to know who they are. You know, uh, why are you looking to be online? What ha what captured your interests? Uh, are you married? Do you have children? Uh, you know, what do you do for fun? And, and different questions, um, you know, are they working? Um, and you just get to know them. You just ask questions. One, you know, you don't have to answer this question. <laughs> I'm gonna check that off. <laughs> you don't do things like that. Um, uh, you just want to talk. Yes, we all have. Uh... <laughs> you see, I couldn't read your comment, Pearl, and I pressed the button and music. Uh, music to my ears. <laughs> um, but uh, when we get to know the, uh, 
who your audience is. You know, you just ask them questions. And let me read some of the questions that I have after are you married and have children. Uh, what do you do for fun? I said I already said those things, right? Um, would making five hundred dollars more a week, a day, uh, a, a month? Which would you prefer? Um, and if they ask me why, it would depend on how much time they'd willing to invest in marketing, right? So, um, you know, that's in another mental check. If they say a daily five hundred dollars, you know, that would uh, we would say, you know, you, you know, this is how much time you would have to put into it. Uh, this is how much marketing. This is how much, uh, um, you know, uh, if you if you even want marketing. So you want to talk to people and say and just get to know, giving them the facts. You want to give the facts to the people so that they aren't coming in on the blind and not knowing what to do. Um, so. Um, do you want to be, do you want to spend more time with your family or do you want to work a nine to five? Is this a part-time job? These are more questions that you want to ask. And, um, are you concerned about your finances? Are you trying to get into this uh, business because you need money right now or in the future? Uh, are you looking for retirement or are you looking to win prizes? You saw my ear pods earlier today. I won those. That was a great treat. I also won a blanket and some coffee. I mean, it just keeps coming and coming. So these are different things that um, you want to ask your audience uh, when they're interested. I mean, you don't just go off the street and say, hey, you want to make $500? <laughs> uh, I mean, I guess you could. <laughs> but, um, you know... <laughs> Really? All right, well, tell me, let me know if anybody has ever done that. I would love to hear the responses and if it was anything positive and then what was the outcome. That's pretty interesting, too. But anyway, we want to uh, ask the audience this because we want to uh, uh, help them achieve what they want in their lives, right? Uh, so, hi, John. How are you? Thanks for joining me. I'm glad you're here. Uh, we're just talking about knowing who your audience is and by asking questions you get to know them and, and you would help your audience know what they would like in their future. Hey, my name is Linda Gould and this is my, let me see, today is, um, oh, this is my 56th video. See, I put it on my calendar so I won't forget. This is my 56th video of my 100 video day challenge. And I'm so glad that you're here watching me. And uh, I'll be back tomorrow, another topic. If you like what uh, you heard, if you would like to be one of my audience and have a, a scheduled, scheduled call, I'll ask you these same questions. We'll get to know each other and we'll have a great day. So God bless. I am so thankful to be home. It was a great day today. We asked, uh, for everything this morning that we were anticipating and we got it it was amazing and we just loved it we knew we would but um we said we wanted to catch the 315 train for instance and we were on that 315 train everything came to volition it was awesome so uh, uh do affirmations be positive and um also uh do affirmations with uh, I can do, I can, I can be, and I can do uh, all things. Um, I'm a great marketer. I'm a great online um, salesperson. I'm whatever you want to be, right? So with that, I have a great day. I see my little bags here. So, <laughs> uh, but I'm here doing my live, and I'm thanking you for being here with me. Have a great evening. Bye-bye.